Okay, now we're to the main part of the song where we use the uh, right hand strumming pattern. That's uh, standard flamenco strumming. I made a video about it, but I'll go through it quickly again. Uh, basically, it's uh, so uh, thumb down, thumb up, fingers down, thumb up. We're going to slap the guitar. So that's the first part. So just do that. If you if you don't know that, then you're going to want to practice that part until you can get it up to speed. You're going to have to start slow. And then you're going to want to work it up to speed. Uh, okay, yeah. So after you slap the guitar, then it's fingers up, fingers down, come up. And that's the end of the pattern. So it's. Uh, in the song, he uh, goes between using all his fingers and just his index finger. Uh, it doesn't really matter. Um, yeah. Okay. So we're starting here. Uh, I'm going to go through this part uh, at normal speed, and then we'll go through it. Flamenco uses a standard chord progression of A minor, G, F, E major. Um, starts here. So, okay, that whole part starts here on an octave. We have the 12th fret, the first string, the 9th fret of the 3rd string. And he just starts slowly with his index finger. Starts building up. And then you start the pattern, the strumming pattern. Um, slowly at first. Then once you're up to full speed, you're going to keep playing that for, uh, four measures. And then, um, the first half of the pattern, the part... So basically it's... Basically, you're splitting these two chords into one, uh, one uh, pattern, you're splitting these two into another, so you're going to basically cut the pattern in half to the point where you, the first part you select the guitar. So basically, um, yeah, and then uh, he plays the top two strings really with just his uh, index finger at the pattern so, it's so he's going uh, open four open five 
5 open 7 while he plays the batter. <laughs> twice and then he goes up open he plays open ten, eight. and then he goes back down again and then he plays seven eight seven and then he goes back and five seven five and then he plays the e string After the first time through the pattern, he goes one, four, and then he does it three times. So, so that whole part sounds like this. Um, so when we play an A minor, uh, then he use, also uses the notes uh, on the first string, 8 and 7. When it's G, it's 7, 5. When it's uh, F, it's, it's 4 and 1, but we're going to leave the bar down to cover the 1. And then there's uh, no other notes really on the E. So uh, I'm going to show you how that sounds. So one time through the pattern just the chord and then uh, another time through the pattern on the top notes but uh, it cuts the pattern in half so and then you move down to the next chord and you move down uh, that's different that's uh, basically splitting With just, the, with just the E chord. Um, so he plays through that one full time. Um, throughout the song, he adds little uh, embellishments to the pattern, mostly when he's playing the E chord. Um, once you have this, most of it mastered, you can just play it. Uh, he's just in the middle of the play. Instead of going down at the same time with the fingers, he kind of flicks them down. Like that. And then, uh, so he does that once, and then he goes back to the top. And uh, he goes 4-1, four, 4-1, one, four, one, three times while he's playing E. Uh, no, F. Uh, And then he goes to uh, sort of like a uh, like a bridge, and then he goes to uh, A minor. It's a different it's a different pattern now. Uh, it sounds like this. So it's like a. On, uh, the, on A minor, and then he goes to E. And then he goes back to A minor. Back to E. Now it's back to the, the first original strumming pattern on D minor. Now to A minor. Now E. D minor and he slides up two frets. And then he goes back down. He jumps to A minor for one strum. And then he goes back to D minor. So it's and then he moves down to A minor. And then he goes down to E minor. And then he goes up to A minor. And then uh, this part 
he gets a little bit quieter. So this and he plays one hard A minor, and uh, then he continues to play the strumming pattern while he uh, slides his hands up and down. So and that's just for one or two patterns. And then he goes back to the uh, normal chord progression. Once, and then he does it again. It's the same thing pretty much as the first part. And then he uh, slides around and then he works his way up here. And then he switches his hands over here. Well, down here, he's going like this. At the same time, he's playing this. And then he goes back in, he taps his guitar a couple times. And then he goes back into the standard uh, chord progression. And here there's no notes, no extra notes, just the straight bar chords. tabs and linked into the description if you have any uh questions you can uh send me a message um any song requests or uh simple questions just uh, put them down in the comments i'll respond and uh thank you for watching